Hey, Isla. Can you hear me? Hey, Charlotte. Oh, goodness. Hey, Kia. Hey, Shika. I see y'all. I see y'all. Can y'all hear me okay? Or nah. Hey, Andrina. Hey, Connie. Okay, we sound good. Okay, great, great, great. Hey, Amanda. I just wanted to, you know, chit chat with y'all a little bit while I uh, make a lay. Um, this won't be a long live. I had to leave a little bit earlier than usual. Um, I don't know if y'all can hear the thunder, but I have to pick up my little one. But I needed to come on and say hey to y'all and chit chat with y'all. It's also a little dark because um, there's no sun. It's really gray outside. And y'all know I don't have any, any light in here. Oh, you know what? Let's see. I can turn on this one. That might help a little bit. Thank you, Connie. What are y'all up to this lovely morning? Cooking bacon. Okay. That's not for me, but okay, okay. <laughs> My son loves it, though. Kid, you have to stay off mini page. You have to stay off mini page. It's dangerous. Lenny will have you at Michael's Hobby Lobby finding stores you never heard of. I'm enjoying it too, Connie. I actually had the windows open before the storm got really, really how it is right now. Y'all ignore my tangled uh ribbon. This was literally a, you know what? I need to do this lay anyway. It's for my 10 year old, so we're just gonna get it done. Ooh, a graduation card. Just one or multiple? Yes, Kia. Lenny will have you in the poorhouse. And then the first thing she'll say is, well, I didn't tell you to go buy it. I just wanted to share what I found with you guys. Like that makes it any better. Ooh. 
It's not necessary to go to Michael's. Oh, what kind of cake topper, Amanda? I only do cake toppers for my babies. If it's not for them, they do not get done. Y'all hear that thunder? I don't like that. Sherry, Amanda, I want to see. Ooh, Sherry Shika. Y'all know I like looking at the stuff y'all make. After this, I have um, two more lace to finish and then a bunch of cutouts. All of the lace have cutouts. Um, I have a red, black, and white one that needs cutouts, a navy blue and sky blue that needs cutouts, a green, black, and white one that needs cutouts. I got to have all my cutouts done. I don't like the way that look, y'all. I have um, some mums to make cutouts for already. Hey, Christine. How are you? Oh, you caught that, Connie? <laughs> Hey, Nicole, how are you? Hey, Amethyst. Isn't it pretty? It's a tiny one. I am doing well, hoping the weather doesn't get too, too bad. See, this is why you're supposed to roll your ribbon up, y'all, and not leave it like this on the table. But this is not a tutorial. This is just a chit-chat with my family, so we're just going to let it ride. Oh, yeah, she here. <laughs> she is here. Thank you, Kia. I have to make, make them all at once and then sit down and make all the cutouts at once. It's completely opposite than when I'm working on moms. When I'm working on moms, I do the whole mom and then the cutout and then the next mom and the cutout. But for lays, I do all of the lays first and then sit down at once with the cutouts. It's so relaxing. Um, no, I use grow grain for lace. The only time I use satin is um, tutorials, and then I will post those. But I use grow grain, I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I just think the color is deeper with grow grain than what it is with satin. Like it's, it's brighter. I could be wrong. Let me see if I can make this light not so yellow for y'all. Maybe. Mm -hmm. 
if a person asks for satin, I'll use it, but typically no. And satin actually is cheaper, but I just like the way Girl Green looks and feels. Oh, thank you. I sure will. I will make some lays and post them right on up. I think I have two for sale um, that are satin that I did. One was from the last live I did, and the other one was from the tutorial that I did. The other ones from tutorials, um, they've already sold. <laughs> I didn't catch on at all. But you know, I am never turning down a ribbon. It will all get put to use. Hey, Miss Deborah, how are you this morning? Yes, yes, yes. And with this, it is me. It took me a while. I don't know why I literally fight to get the camera in the right um, direction when I go live on YouTube. It is always a struggle because it wants to go portrait mode since I'm using my other phone. Oh, Ms. Deborah, this is like the most common thing you'll ever come across, I promise. I thought I would use it. I, hey, we're in the same boat, but I know my deadline. I, I bumped my deadline up just for you. Because you said May 26th, and I'm like, mm -mm, I need to be done by May 19th. Let me just pull this out some more. You can't tie your shoes. You know what? I wear slides. I can't tie my shoes either. Y'all, this is why. Yeah, let me turn this this way. This is why I say roll up your ribbon. Because it'll get tangled. I am I am living testimony that do as I say and not as I do because when I don't roll them up this is what happens luckily she's so tiny this isn't um, the usual amount of ribbon that I use Oh, it's not so bad to untangle. Y'all, somebody trying to make my phone go off, but they don't know that I mute my phone before I go live. So, no look there. Mm -hmm. See, I caught you, Connie. I caught you. There we go. I'll be back. I 
think that's how I spelled it too, amethyst, and then realized it was a Y and not an E. Yep, now my phone, um, whenever Connie or Hyla's live and she's chatting, my phone just autocorrects to the way her name is actually spelled now because I've typed it so much. Oh, but you're making my watch buzz. Let me take my watch off. <laughs> See. <laughs> Nice, play nice. Oh, y'all. Okay, so, um, yes, that's exactly what I was getting ready to say, too, Connie. Um, Lini Alexis Designs. She is here on YouTube. I've shared her before. She's also on TikTok. She posted this shop on Etsy. Um, she has an Etsy shop, so she has two. Um, she posted this shop on Etsy called uh, BBJ Craft. I'm gonna have to link it in this video just to show y'all. She makes these physical acrylic watermarks. I did an unboxing, but y'all know I am terrible with uploading videos. I have to show y'all the rest. They are so pretty. And of course, I had to get black and gold. And then I have one with just TJ's Magic Touch. And I had to get one for my mom because, you know. And she did a special one for me um, that I can hang. So when I'm taking pictures, excuse the glitter, I was making a glitter lay. Um, when I'm taking pictures of my mom's, I'm just going to hang this instead of trying to watermark all over the mom. I'm going to hang it off the front of my mom and then just cut it off before I ship obviously but oh yeah oh yeah so big 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 thanks and shout out to Lenny because I saw hers and I was like I want them I gotta get me some I put them in my cart and then um she sent me an Etsy gift card so I am extremely extremely grateful Thank you, Hyla. Thank you, Connie. Thank you, Amanda. I thought so. I was like, man, I have to have it. So I got all my colors. Y'all know I love yellow. That one's a, obviously a pastel yellow, but I love it. Oh, yeah, because that's an expensive piece of equipment that Glowforge, but she makes all kinds of really nice um acrylic signs I'll tag her shop once I get off live and update my description and thumbnail and all that kind of good stuff she was really sweet like um I was like I hope it's not weird that I'm asking for like a hole or whatever in the top <laughs> 
she sent the proof to make sure that I liked it before she cut it out. Really nice. I have one. I just don't know if um if I want to use it or if I want to um use the string to just add an additional trinket once I cut off the watermark. At least that's where my mind was going. But I actually do have one. Oh no. So that sound different. Sorry. That's my uh it's eleven o'clock notification, y'all. That way, um, That way I know it's almost time to pick up my little one. Right? Physical watermarks is definitely where it's at. Make sure my alarm don't go off again, y'all. Okay, there we go. Yes, I have to go get Tornado. <laughs> I have to get her. Um, as I was saying earlier, I'm going to have to leave. A smidge earlier. I've seen you a picture. It's a um, it's a tripod, Connie, and I have it sitting beside me, which is why I'm kind of like off to the side, and the camera's over it. But there are definitely times where I run into it. I'll send you a picture. And it came with like a little remote or whatever. I don't use all of that. Yes, yes, yes. A big thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. See, I forget to say all of that stuff for myself. I say that for y'all. Thank you, Amethyst. I would like to say that I do. Yep, yep.
I'll tell y'all why I am sitting here, but I'll definitely put it in the, um, what you call it, up, see, knock the camera. This ribbon is Paper Mart. Y'all know I love Paper Mart. Can y'all see all of that goodness? The 3 8 inch grow grain, Paper Mart. And red straight red and then three eighths inch grow grain paper mark and black and it's all ugly outside i'm not gonna be able to take a picture of this lay so my thumbnail gonna be looking a little rough y'all I just update my thumbnail tomorrow. Y'all be okay, right? <laughs> I made a little generic one. Um, I don't know, a couple months ago. Whenever I did the very first random live on my baby's first day of school, I made a "Hey y'all, let's chat" thumbnail. So that's what's there right now. Um, but I'll update it with pictures and all of that. I'm just, you know. Honey, you do not have to be um, artsy to make a thumbnail. Go on Canva. They're like right there, pre-made. Hey, Annabelle. Thank you. Go on Canva and type in YouTube thumbnail. And they have a whole bunch of templates. You can just stick your pictures on there. They even have the fonts already there. for Canva? <sighs> Connie. We're going to have to have a chit chat about you wasting resources. Because if you're paying for Canva, you should definitely not have any issues with thumbnails. Because if you have access to all of the pro features, Hi, love. <laughs> I need y'all to not pay for software and not use it. I'll do a few Canva tutorials for you, Connie. How about that? Especially so you can use Eddie because I need to see Eddie print on some cookies. It does take up a lot of space. Um, Hyla, just use a portable hard drive for it. But, you know, I have three, um, three hard drives 
So I'm probably not the person to talk to about that because I spend money on on storage. My portable hard drive is 12 terabytes. Oh, I said I would do a Canvas tutorial for you, or a couple. There's actually a few, um, a few items I've been asked for, for Canva. Andrina, y'all are hurting my feelings. Y'all are y'all are really tap dancing on the graphic designer in me. That y'all paying for software and not using it. Okay, Connie. I do need to do some more Photoshop too. Ugh. It's so much work, y'all. But Canva is coming. Connie, we live in Texas. Why you pay for monthly car wash? It's raining right now. Not the whole cloud. Y'all heard my feelings. You know how much stuff is in the creative cloud? One of the things I want to learn that's in there is Adobe Premiere. And it's like supposedly really good video editing software. That's something that just kind of sits for me. But. I need y'all to use all this stuff y'all paying for. Oh no, I'm I'm scared of hell, Connie. Terrified. And man, do you see Connie? Just ridiculous. Y'all see, we are almost done. Let me get the back. Good luck, Vanessa. If you need help, just come back over here. And I will gladly help you out. They're really easy, though, I promise. One of the main things you have to remember is the top. And you see how you have to cross. So it kind of tells you what you have to do. And this top one that you're tightening, you use that same ribbon to go back inside. Once you have that down, the rest is super easy. 
see, we're gonna pull here to tighten and use that same ribbon to loop and go back inside. Thank you, Annabelle. It's um, 3 eighths inch in width. I was about to say it's for my baby girl. It's for my big girl, actually. It's for my teen year old. Thank you, Connie. Thank you, Amanda. Elementary, fifth grade graduation. My oldest is seventh grade. We had um, his awards ceremony last week. I thought Tornado was going to have one, but they're doing a fun day, and we get to be a part of it, so I'm going to be up there with her for her um, pre-K fun day. Um, for numbers, um, I use cardstock, um, foam tape to give it depth, and on the back of it, depending on if they want it permanent or removable, I'll use either a hot glue or a pin back. And yes, you can add money flowers. It's best to use um, fake money like the prop money that you can get on Amazon. That way they're not tearing their layup in order to get to the money at the end of graduation. Just give the graduate the cash straight up and put the play money on the lay. And for that, you just use the string or the thread that you use to do the money flowers and then you just loop it through or glue it since it'll be um, prop money. She's getting one, Hyla. I'm gonna do a little, um, a little one, but a little chunky one. So I'm gonna use, I think that ribbon is like one inch thick. And it, um, and white because her her shirt is purple and white I'm so proud of you, Kia. Using your Canva. Y'all better start using this software. I'm all for it. Except for Microsoft. Y'all don't beat me up. It's just so difficult to do anything in Microsoft. It's possible. It's just a little few extra steps.
problem is I try to keep all of my software on one device. It's all on my iPad, and I don't know how much the other computers can hold, and I want to make sure they can run the software. Connie, that is a very big problem. <laughs> Very, very big problem. If you're going to have it just in one spot, you need to have a lot of storage space. And then you're going to need extra space on top of that to um, to store whatever, whatever designs you're working on. Um, it depends depends on how many ribbons I'm using, how long it has to be, and whether or not I'm interrupted. If I can just sit um, with no interruptions anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. Um, but if the kids are here and I have to stop a lot, that changes my completion time but usually if I can just sit uninterrupted about 30 minutes to an hour this one's actually a little bit shorter than what I normally do because again it's for my 10 year old so instead of using um seven yards of ribbon I only used five well five for each piece Hmm. I don't like that language. Let's not be insulting. Thanks. No, oh, thank you. But the answer is no. I mean, I'll do the FaceTime, but the rest of that you can keep to yourself. <laughs> I knew you'd love this red. Oh, there we go, y'all. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. Y'all would go tell me, TJ, you out of ribbon? So, this is what I was talking about in the tutorial. Um, there are people who make lace, and they'll put their um, two outside ribbons, like 12 inches, 24 inches, a yard even shorter than the two inside colors just so they don't have this excess but I am this is already um it's not already tied I did that whole lay without tying my knot y'all that's no bueno but I'll pull the ribbon through and then cut it can you see Um, starting them at different lengths in the beginning, Connie, 
that's how you keep them from being different links. But sometimes, like, I like this pattern, um, red, black, red, with the black in the center. So I could have done it with this one because I knew that's how I wanted it. But sometimes I change it and I may want red in the center or I may want it to be the same on each side. So I don't cut at different lengths just in case I decide I want something different instead. But that's how you do it is your two outside pieces. You cut it differently. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> you know, I'm all about answering questions. So we're going to pull through. Get some scissors and snip, snip my longer pieces. sure nothing is wrinkled. Oh, I get to be at the party in a sense. <laughs> I hope y'all absolutely love it. I did something on his that nobody else will ever, ever get. <laughs> Actually, two somethings nobody else will ever, ever get. There we go. I'm going to do a little lay and then I'll do the back. this way instead of on the side how I like to do them. Am I fuzzy? Are y'all losing me? Thank you, Hyla. Oh, no, ma'am. Nobody gets to see it before Connie and Matthew. No, no, no. I'll just tell them they can actually go to the tutorial and with this because I did say all of that in the tutorial. Like, don't be expecting me to be technical in my lives when I'm just trying to talk to my peeps. Okay. So here it is, y'all. So we call it baby. I think I want to cut just a little bit more off of that one. Can I be fancy now? Put my little word mark up front.
Thank you, Connie. Thank you, Hyla. That was actually perfect timing because it is 11.30 and I have to prepare to fight the weather to get um, like that. To go get my little tornado from school. Thanks, Amanda. I will, Connie. Luckily, I don't have to go far. Um, her school, normal conditions, her school is a nine-minute drive away. Christy, for this pattern, I did red, black, black, red. That's how I started. Thank you, Hyla. Bye, Nicole. Thank you, Amethyst. I will, Chrissy. Thank you. Thank you, Sheikha. Thank you, Nicole. Thank you, Amethyst. You have a great day also. Any questions before I sign off? You're welcome. Chrissy, are you in the Facebook group? Because I'll just upload a little picture in there um, this afternoon. Honey, when will I be back live? Okay, I'll um I'll upload a a picture. If I forget, blame my mind, not my heart, because you know it goes a million miles a minute. But I can upload a little. Um, picture in there how I laid the ribbons out so you can see yes Christy one big mumbly y'all gonna get sick of me during homecoming season bye Amanda you're welcome thanks for joining y'all make this process so much easier for me <laughs> Thank you, Ira. Okay, I'm going to get out of here, y'all, while it's still a little bit quiet. Oh, yeah, right there. And I'm also going to put it in my description, too. Of course, I have to go pick up Tornado and come back, so my description box won't be filled out. But after I... um. After I get back, I'll fill out the description box. So the Facebook group will be there um, for anybody that wants to see mom stuff or my lay stuff or whatever. Thank you, Hyla. I will. Oh, my goodness. Hey, Coretta, I'm actually getting off. But hey, hey, hey. Bye, Andrina. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Hopefully next time, though. Next time I'm live, you can join but I always have to get off around this time, so I have to go pick up my little one. Yes, Connie, go. Matter of fact, go on Canva. Go on Canva and type in YouTube thumbnail. And literally just upload your pictures. The font and everything is already there for you, love. Oh, Lord, my number's going back up. Okay, y'all, I'm going to get off of here because now it's 11.35, and I have nine minutes without bad weather to get there. So any questions y'all have, y'all know, just put them in the comments. I answer everybody, even I go through because 
YouTube is like really strict with the filtering and I don't know why but questions have been going to needing approval I don't know why I'm not filtering y'all's questions um so I answer whatever y'all ask if you're in the Facebook group ask over there I'll answer over there whenever I um whenever I see it thank you Sheikha have a good day let me slide out of here y'all how slide out of here Oh my goodness. Y'all forgot how to end my live. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> Bye, y'all.